The experiments you will see have been carefully done by professionals and should not be tried at home without parental guidance. Please follow the caution signs throughout this program. Creation is science, where we learn about our Savior, Jesus Christ. And you know, when we invite him in our hearts, we can grow and do amazing things. I'm here with Alexander, Angelica, Logan, and Josiah, and of course, Professor Roy. What are we learning today? Well, we're going to be looking at some different kinds of fluids. And it's a, something that we call a non-Newtonian fluid. Newtonian fluid. Yeah, hmm. non-Newtonian. Now, there's somebody's <laughs> name in there. Whose name is that? Newton. You remember Newton? Oh! Yeah, Sir Isaac Newton. You know, he was a, a 17th century scientist, an educator, mm -hmm. a philosopher, an amazing man, man. okay? Mm -hmm. But he came up with some laws. And uh, one of those things that's talked about today is the law of viscosity. And that's kind of cool. You know, some liquids act like a liquid and some liquids can act like a solid. Isn't that amazing? It's kind of yes. frustrating, isn't it? I mean, which is it? Is it a liquid or, or is a it solid. a solid? Okay, sometimes things act the same way, either a liquid or a solid. And that's what our lesson is about today, which okay. is kind of cool. Actually, uh, I've got some things right here. Let's take a look at this. What, what is this right here? Sometimes toothpaste. it's toothpaste, okay? And this is considered to be a non-Newtonian fluid. Interesting, isn't it? Because it can be a solid and it can be a liquid, depending upon the pressure that we put on it. I've got some other things as well. You recognize this, don't you? Ketchup. ketchup. It's ketchup. Now, have you ever had a hard time getting ketchup out of a bottle? Yes. Yeah, I mean, I've seen people squeeze it, and that usually <laughs> doesn't work if it's a glass bottle. And I've seen people go like this. Have you seen them go like that? Or go like this, mm -hmm. like that? But, you know, it usually comes out a little bit better if you do what? Tap just it. Shake, just shake, shake it. it. Just shake it. Okay, so this can act like a solid that can't come out, or it, it comes out kind of hard. Mm -hmm. And then if you shake it, sometimes it comes out even too fast. Have you ever had it come out too fast? Right. Yeah, that could be a problem. Then I've got some other things right here. We use this in cooking and baking. What, what comes in containers like that? Cornstarch. Cornstarch, that's right. Sometimes we could call it corn flour, but it's cornstarch. And so cornstarch is a non-Newtonian fluid. That's pretty cool. Well, would you like to make a non-Newtonian fluid? Would you like to make one? <laughs> yes. Okay, well, we've got some examples right here. First of all, let's go ahead and put our safety yep. glasses on because we're using some things that we just don't want to get in our eyes. Would you like to get cornstarch in your eyes? No. Ah, I, I wouldn't know. want to do that. That's what we have. On your table, you have a cup of cornstarch, and then you have a liquid. What's it? What's the liquid? Water. water. It looks like water, and it is water, and you also have a zip bag. So what we'd like to have you do is to, you can help each other, but you can pour the fluid in there, and you can pour the cornstarch in there. Want then we help? want to seal it up, then we want you to start to mix it, okay? And as you mix it, you it, it should yourself. become what we're talking you might about. Do... There you go. Okay, you want to open your bag? You want the whole thing, and you or can, just try a little bit. You want to help him open his bag and pour okay. his stuff in there? There you go. We're going to mix it up. Let's we're going to mix out. it up. Let's get some of the air. Now, if we mix it up with our hands, we'd make a big mess. So we're going to make a big mess a little bit later. <laughs> okay. And how are we doing? How does that feel? This feels like using sweet potatoes flour. <laughs> it does, doesn't it? We've so, used this. What is it? We've used this in cooking. Oh, you have? Yeah, we can use cornstarch. Yeah, Sometimes can we can it. take cornstarch, and it can be a substitute for egg, right? It can be. All right, and go. so we're just gonna mix it all up and we'll mix it all up. Okay, and that feels kind of soft, right? It feels kind of soft and pliable, right? How's it coming? It, I'm it, finding some chunks in it. You're finding some uh, bumps in there? Yeah. Okay, Wait. all right, that's interesting. Now, what I'm gonna do right here, I mix them up right here. I mix them up right here in this container right here. Let's take the lid off and take a look at this. This is interesting, and in fact, We've got about eight of these, eight of these containers making up that much cornstarch with water. 
And this is called a non-Newtonian fluid. So sometimes it acts as a what? Um, liquid. As a liquid, and sometimes it acts as a? Help me. Solid. As a solid. <laughs> That's exactly right. And it all depends on the amount of pressure or force that we put on it, okay, which is very, very interesting. So let's see what we've got right here. Now, I've got this in here. Wow, look at that. And it looks kind of, it's like a, like a jello almost, it isn't it? But you know what? What I can do is, well, what you can do is we can take that and we can take your hand or your fist, right? Take your fist, and if we hit it really hard, right? If we hit it really hard and take your hand away, it acts like and it feels just like a solid. Would you like to try first? <laughs> <She's> <laughs> Would you like, like to right try it? <laughs> no. No. Oh, man. Would you oh, like Logan, to try well, it? Oh, Logan, come yeah. on, Logan. Okay, okay. All right, so here we go. All right, so just take your hand and just hit it Punch real it. hard and come Punch back. It. Whoa. Oh, Look at that. Wow. Well, it got moist, but it didn't sink down in there. You want to try it? Look at that, isn't that amazing? You can just hit it, hit it, hit it. And now, you can see the ripples, but it you, doesn't go down. And it doesn't go down. So what did we do? We put a lot of stress, a lot of force on it, and those little pieces of cornstarch are getting all together and it acts like, oh, go, go ahead and hit it, just right, here we go. Yeah, just hit it hard. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Yeah, oh man, that's pretty cool, isn't it? Sure. Now, now another thing, what, I'm sorry. If you applied enough force, would it crack? Uh, yes, it actually would. Okay, now, let's see what, let, um, what I'm gonna do is we want somebody to take this and we're going to dip your hands in there and, and grab, grab a handful, grab a handful. Okay, uh, and keep your hands, yeah, and make a ball out of it. And as long as you keep it pressure on it, oh, right, it, just... it will do what? As long as he keeps pressure on it, it will stay as a solid. Okay, and I'll stop and just hold it like that, hold it up. What happens when he stopped? When he removed the pressure, how did it act? It just, how did it act? It just melted away. Just melted away, it acted like a what? Liquid. Like a liquid. Okay, so let's, okay, all right, so we've got that. And you know what, uh, Auntie, we've got yes. some water right there in a container because this will rinse off your hands really, really nicely, okay? And then we can, and then we can, oh, and then we can dry them here. off. Just make a ball out of it and pr put pressure on it. Put hands. pressure on it and it stays as a ball. When you take the pressure off and just hold your hand out, it just, just, it just kind of like it melts away and it turns right into a liquid. Isn't that amazing? It is. Yeah, just grab a handful. Come on over here, Angelica. Grab a yeah. handful. Well, there we go. That's right. And put and pressure on it. Just make a ball like you're making a, a snowball. Put I pressure mean. on it. And see, it stays as a solid, doesn't it? And then hold your hand out and just hold it in your hand. Well, see what happens? It likes it turns it back into a liquid. So that's what, that, it acts <laughs> like a what? A non-Newtonian fluid, which it really is. Now, you know what, that is kind of related. Have you ever heard of quicksand? Yes. Okay, what do we know about quicksand? Sink. <laughs> what do we know about quicksand? It Help. looks like it's solid, but it's actually liquid. Yeah, have you ever been stuck or in an area that had quicksand? Yeah. Have you ever been? No. You have? No, no. You have? Can you tell us about it? Like I put my foot in there and it sank my two feet in. And you, and you sunk down in there? That was amazing, but wasn't it? But then I got out. But you got yeah. out. That's you know, a good thing. <laughs> you know, not very many people have died because they've gotten, they drowned in quicksand. You know, if you ever get stuck in quicksand, you know what the best thing to do is? What? what? Try to just get on your back, okay, because you want to have a lot of surface area over there. And then you can kind of move very, very slowly and try to get your body out. That's very interesting. There's usually only two or three, maybe four feet of that sand, which is quicksand. I think that's interesting, don't you? It is. I do, too. Now, right. what we're going to do is this. Yeah, I'm going to take and I'm going to put this over here on the front. So go ahead and rinse your hands off. Rinse your hands off. And I'm just gonna put this down. Let me put this down over here. And your hands just All right. And you know what? I think we got some people with some bare feet. Oh boy. <laughs> Let's check <laughs> this out. All right, here we go. Now, what we need is, we need a victim. I mean a volunteer. <laughs> okay, you wanna help me? Okay, come on over here. Okay, here we go. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this down right here. All right, let me move this down here. Help me scoot this away from here. All right, there we, that's fine. Here we go. And I'm gonna put this just like this. All right, remember, <laughs> if we hit it real hard, what does it do? 
acts like a what? Solid. solid. A solid. I can it hit it real hard. Now, very, very carefully, uh, why don't you just step in there and just stand there. And just stand there. Just stand there. Just stand. <laughs> That's right. I'll help you hold it. What's happening to his feet? It's sinking. He's sinking down in there. <laughs> How come he's sinking down in there? Right, getting his do weight. We, do we have a, a lot of pressure on there? Yes. Yeah. But it's it real fast. No, it's not real fast. And he's sinking down in there. Okay, now tell. Whoa, okay, pull it out. Be careful. Uh oh. Careful, careful. <laughs> I better get my bucket. Can you pull it out. His feet? Can you can you pull your foot out. <laughs> I'm okay. coming. You're stuck. You're stuck. You're stuck. Okay. And we've got we a go. container right here. Here we go. All right, there we go. Get your foot back. Yeah. Put get, put your put your, put your messy one in here. <laughs> Put your messy one in there. We're going to clean your foot up. All right. <laughs> okay, just like that. Okay, all right. We got. We have a towel for you as well. Yep, we okay. do. Now, what we want to try to do is we want to try to see if we can. We've got a big one. Look at this. We've got a big area of our uh, uh, oobleck. We call this oobleck. Say that. Oobleck. 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 We just made oobleck by mixing cornstarch with water. Okay, are you all cleaned up? No. Not quite. Not He's quite. On it. Okay. No, that, no, you should have that, taken that. a shower first. <laughs> no, you're good. You're good. I think it's okay. You okay, all right. So out. we're going to move this stuff out all of the right. way. Actually, right, let's move that out of our way. Okay, hey, thanks for doing that for us. Okay, yes, step Logan. on over there. I actually took a right. shower just last night. Okay, now let's see what we've got. I'm going to take the lid off of this. Here we go. And we got we got something that we can put down on the floor. Do we have something that we can put down on the yes. floor? Yes, yes. Okay, here we go. Now don't try this out. All right. So you want it on this side? Where yeah, right this? there. Yeah, okay. right there. Okay. okay, all right. Okay, who wants to be the first? Me. No, you you were first. Okay. <laughs> Who wants to be first? What we want you to do is we want you to take and we want you to run right run over that. Fast. You're gonna put your feet, you can put one foot there, your next foot goes there, and your last we foot goes over there. You wanna? Okay, all right, so come over here. Now we don't wanna stop there. We wanna keep moving, right? Okay, so we're gonna keep moving. <laughs> Let me go ahead. Okay, all right, are we ready? I don't think it's that okay. deep. Are we ready? Are we ready? <laughs> okay, run, 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 run right through there. Leave your lab coat down. You're fine. <laughs> Go for it. Come on, Josiah. <laughs> Woo! Yes, yes, yes. Who's next? Who's next? Who's next? Okay, here we go. Maybe here we I go. better. Here we go. Maybe okay, I better okay, move go. out of the okay, way. Move out of the way. We got wait, wait, some wait. more I'm coming. Gonna, I'm going to open yes, this up. Yes, we got some more I coming. I need to make it wider. Okay, all right. Are you ready? Going. Okay, boom, boom, boom. Run through it. Look at that. He didn't sink down. Who's next? Good Come job. on here. Line up down here and you can Come go through. Come on down here. Line up. Come on, Come on down. Come on down. Come, Come on, on down. Alexander. Come on down. You can Antique do that. Antique Francine. Come on. You oh, I have to Okay, let's go. Okay. Run right through. Run right through. Come on. Run, 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 run. Look at that. She didn't even sink down. Who's next? Run right through. Run right through. Quick, quick, quick. You gotta go quick. No, no, you gotta go quick. You gotta go quick. Bam, 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 bam. Go, 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 go. Come here, Angelica. Okay, Manti. Come on, you gotta do it. The last one. All right. Woo! Wow. Hey, did that work great? It worked great. It now, worked great. I don't know about you, but I love things like that because it, we, it plays a little trick on your mind, doesn't it? It does. It's it a mental like a liquid, thing that you have to think about right for sure. It. That's right. You know, I'm thinking about how we can be either hard or cold for Christ in our heart and with the words that we say, like in Ephesians 4.29, we can have, use our hearts to witness to others and say nice and graceful things to other people. And sometimes our words can be harsh and turn people away. So let's make sure that our words are kind and thoughtful so we can be a witness for others. Thanks for joining us on Creation is Sunday!